Smart farms here in Seoul are taking fresh produce harvested within urban settings to local tables. Our Ishihu got a taste. Metro Farm, a collaboration between Seoul Metro and agricultural firm Farm 8, is the name of the underground farms located at select subway stations in the capital. Even without natural sunlight, vegetables grow with the help of technology. Instead, LED lights replace the role of the sun. Now, at a recently renovated Metro Farm in Changdo Subway Station on Line 7, special classes are being offered for children as part of what's called the Farm Academy. They get to plant vegetable seeds in wet sponges. Then they change into the right apparel before entering the smart farm. The students harvest lettuce, which is used to make salads and other dishes at the farm's cafe. Straight from farm to table, the vegetables can be eaten fresh. On the rooftop of a company building in Sochogu district in Seoul, sunlight seeps through the ceiling, providing light to the plants below. This farm uses both sunlight and LED lights to grow a variety of vegetables like tomatoes and bell peppers. It also uses other types of technology. This urban smart farm uses cameras and sensors to monitor the conditions of the greenhouse and maintain the environment so it's optimal for growth. Temperature, humidity, the amount of carbon dioxide and light are constantly gauged and controlled. This is an automated system of AI technologies that allow the gathering of phenotype data and automatic irrigation and cultivation of plants. A phenotyping robot measures the size of the plants with minimal human assistance. The farm is being used to collect data on smart farming as well as for produce in the cafeteria right beside it. Smart farms are eco-friendly in that they don't require the use of pesticides. The water used in irrigation can also be recycled. Smart farms provide eco-friendly ways for people to enjoy fresh produce even in urban environments with limited space. Lee Si-hoo, Arirang News.